anyone who's hired will tell you, you cannot magically scale expertise by hiring people. It lives in your brain. And traditionally, there have been only three ways to scale expertise, and all of them suck. All of them are bad. And AI created a fourth way. So let me show you the problem. Option number one, this sucks, work more hours. Say you're a lawyer, you're great at what you do. The client demand goes up, you work nights and weekends, you burn out, this doesn't scale, or else you just pad the billing hours, whatever it is. But the point is, you can't scale your hours infinitely. There is not infinite time. Option two, hire people. You hire associates. Maybe you hire junior lawyers. They don't scale expertise. They dilute expertise. And the point is they don't have the years of pattern recognition that go with true expertise. And I have worked with senior, senior engineers, people who are at the principal level or above. It's the same thing. And you end up trading your work for management work, and that is draining, and you're still the bottleneck. Option number three, the only way we've found to scale that doesn't suck as bad as working more hours and hiring more people is raising your prices. So great, you charge more, you go, you raise your hourly rates. The lawyer raises the hourly rates to 600 bucks an hour, a thousand bucks an hour, but there's a ceiling. Eventually you're too expensive for most clients and you've traded volume for rate and you're still limited to the amount of time that you have. These are your options. This is why any expertise-based business hits a wall. This is true whether you're in the legal profession or whether you are a senior principal architect or whether you are a uh, tradesman, whether you're in plumbing or whether you're installing HVAC systems, your expertise hits a wall by scale. Your knowledge is the asset and it's been trapped and there's been only one of you.